we've got another update. This is 3.0.5. Um, as you see, we've still got the larger font on the display. We've still got the ability that the receiver doesn't fall, uh, default to the uh, FM band anymore. This is uh, 21 megs, the last band I had it on. There is a 3.0.6. I tried uh, flashing that and it locked the radio into um, uh, VHF FM mode. So I went back down to 3.0.5. That's what we've got here. Okay, the main, what are the main changes? Well, we've got uh, an extra sort of um, VHF low band which appears to run from 64 to 84 okay as well as the uh, traditional um, FM band which goes from 84 to 108 so we've got that um, we we'll go back into um, so the, the HF area now more use of the encoder wheel in this sketch um, for example if we press the volume up button you'll see the volume is highlighted here and we adjust the volume okay using the encoder wheel now I'm aware my encoder is going the wrong way because I need to amend that in the sketch it always happens when I do an upgrade so there's the volume look using the encoder wheel and to get out of the volume setting we press volume again uh, on a similar vein we can press the step button you'll see the step is highlighted here we turn the encoder wheel we're in five we've got one we've got 100 we've got 50 we've got 10 we press step again and we're now in 10 kilohertz steps uh, bandwidth again we press the bandwidth button it's highlighted then we turn the wheel we can go from four six We've got 1, 1 1.82, 2.5, 3, 4, and 6. Let's go for 6. We just press the bandwidth button, and there we go. We're back in um, uh, the, the normal um, VFO mode. So those are the main changes as I see them. A um, lot more use of the encoder wheel um, to adjust these functions. I, it's probably a matter of preference whether you find that... Um, useful or not it probably reduces the um, the strain uh, on, on using these buttons but then we're using the encoder wheel more so I don't know um, as I say um, some um, some nice touches we've got an extra we've got a hundred kilohertz step on here now we've got an extra uh, VHF FM band which I think is is for the Eastern European regions and I think Ricardo's also done some work on the RDS decoding but I'm in such a poor VHF location here I'd have to take the radio outside to, um, uh, to, to see if that's made any difference but there you go um, that's the, uh, the latest sketch I've uploaded and um, hope you enjoyed uh, hope you enjoyed seeing that